how does this work? Well, Deirdre, you know, we're actually hearing reports from Israel that when the sirens go off, Israelis, instead of running to their shelters, stay outside to watch Iron Dome in action. So here's how it works. Hamas fires a missile. And then what happens is the Iron Dome detects the missile headed into Israeli airspace. It traces the trajectory. That data is then relayed to the Battle Management and Control Unit to determine the impact and whether it's headed toward populated areas. If it is, then the coordinates are then sent out and the missile firing unit launches a missile to intercept the incoming threat. Now that radar has been, that radar guided missiles were developed uh, by Rafael Adva Advanced Defense Systems. It's an Israeli company, but in 2011, Raytheon announced a partnership agreement uh, to market the system overseas. No sales have been announced yet. Now in a call with President Obama over the weekend, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu expressed deep appreciation for the money that the U.S. and President Obama himself has provided to fund the system, which he said has saved countless Israeli lives. Since 2010, Obama has requested about $650 million for Israeli missile defense systems, for Iron Dome, $205 million in the fiscal 2011 budget. And back in July 2012, the president provided an additional $70 million to maximize production. And Deirdre, most went to the south, so you're seeing those dollars helping Israelis right now. And over the next three years, uh, the Obama administration could try to add more funding uh, for the Iron Dome. One report said $610 million.